It's your boy Mikey with We Talking Media. I just came back from watching the fight tonight again. Remember, I told you I'm an avid hand to hand, feet to feet combat guy. I love to watch it, man. I really do. And tonight was Izzy Azasanya, the Stylebender versus Sean Strick. And you're like, this is We Talking Media, though. Well, this is part of the media and a lesson learned, I think, in adaptation. Okay? See, when you, when you stay the same and you keep your same style, and that goes for me and everybody. You know what happens to you? People catch up. And only one problem with life that no matter how well you're doing right now, you got to always realize the gray hairs is waiting behind you. They're always behind you waiting, ready to catch up with you. You'll never be 25 again. Okay? Remember that as you work hard through these days. And remember that from 25 to 30, you have to change. From 30 to 35, you have to change. From 35 to 40, you have to change. From 40 to 45, you have to change again. Your body ages and your mindset has to change. And also, how you prepare yourself has to change. Okay? Now, where am I going with this? Style Bender is being promoted by Dana White. Dana White needs a cash cow as, as a champion of champions. Okay? Had a great comeback fight versus Perea, Alex Perea. Uh, I watched I watched K one K boxing. I was I was watching Glory. I knew all these guys before all, all this UFC stuff. So just a heads up, all right? Perea comes in as as you know the 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 the, the you know the Batman around. What do you call it? The Joker. To, no, I don't want to call it that, man. All right. Perea comes in as the Kryptonite to to El Superman of, of Mister Adesanya. Knocks him out first time. Uh, out of sound, he comes back, knocks him out the second time. No rematch. Prayer is too big, too heavy. Can't get back down to that weight. Out of Sonya has had a lot of close fights, but the style bender style is pretty much very, very, very predictable. Okay, I know what he does now. He's done it so many times. Same left to right, left to right, and it, and he thinks he's advanced to a point where. He's unstoppable. His head is to the clouds. Sean Strickland is a journeyman, okay? If you want to call this David and Goliath, you can't. Journeyman, a guy that's got beaten up a lot, a stepping stone for a lot of folks to get into the championship. However, in his career, with his, even with his record, his main goal was to what? Keep working hard every day, okay? And, in, and master and master what he has. So, because mastering something is also a change and an, and an improvement. So, if you go from 25 to 35 and you're doing the same thing, but you've mastered it and you've added a couple little wrinkles to the game, you've changed something. You know what I'm saying? You got a little better. Maybe the jab gets a little bit crisper. The left hook comes up a little off a little bit more angle. Maybe you have the same style to the naked eye of a human, but what you do in the ring, those slight adjustments make it a change i didn't see none of that from adesanya i see adesanya all over the papers and the news he remind me of diddy all right he's a fun guy he likes to have fun i saw his body even though he's very skinny it didn't look like he was in full shape sorry um, i gotta call a spade a spade adesanya did not look like he was prepared it looks like he was stuck on i'm still 25 years old and I can catch this guy with no problem, okay? I can catch him without even working out, okay? I only trained two, three weeks for this guy. That's what it felt like. And Izzy, old bad boy, in his hometown, has really solidified himself as not a GOAT. I'll tell you why he's not a GOAT, all right? If you look at goats through every single, and this is my opinion, go ahead and nag me if you want. Just put your opinion down, man. Let, let it be heard. We here to argue. We got we got time, man. We got a little time in this life, right? If you look at records of other type of sports, and I don't want to go boxing because it's one it's one methodology, but you think about a, a, a Khabib Nurmagomedov, okay? You look at John Jones, who I think is definitely the goat with his with his with his ability. To focus and add wrinkles, even though it looks like he's not to his fight. Okay. Even though it looks like he's not, he is. All right. I don't see John Jones party as much. Megan flipped out, called Karen. Okay. Yeah. I mean, simple enough. John Jones is a guy that I think is always adding to his repertoire, even though. 
He's he's kind of a party, but he has kids. All right. Itasanya, I believe, is still single, doing the boat thing, Kim Kardashian thing. I saw girls inside of the uh there goes 32 million. It's not what you think. Okay, well, that there here goes strike five, guys. Here goes strike five. Look at the mansion. All right. It it is true, and and I think my man Deontay Wilder said it best. It's hard going for a two mile run, a run with with, with, with with a Gucci with a Gucci nightgown on. All right, it's hard going for a two mile run at four a.m., five a.m. in the morning, or a ten mile run with Gucci. Okay, hold on, I made the bitch come. I mean, twi this kid, you can see where I'm going with this. Okay, let's go, let's go out of Sonya dating all right i hate to go there guys but i'm just giving you the full perspective on what i think is going on. sean is i bet sean strickland is, is is consistent he's consistent this guy this guy a little too much the, a little too flashy he has to be right that's part that's part of the selling factor the only problem that is izzy seems to think that he's still 26 27 years old okay that's when we was doing these things, right? Everyone does it to a scale. Again, I'm not, not obviously not at his level, but everyone has that fun to a scale. And I believe Izzy Adesanya, oh Lord, I was gonna say, hopefully she didn't do that with him. <laughs> that that would have that would have really, yeah. Anyway, how am I going there? Um, and and, and that would really tell me something, okay? Yeah, this is fucking embarrassing. That was fucking embarrassing. That's Conor McGregor. Well, you had several like that. All right. Yeah. You know, he's a little too much full of himself, in my opinion. All right. I do like the kid's style. I love, I love him. Uh, with, you know, a couple fights. I like the Pereira rematch and that comeback. That was unbelievable. But to not defend that, Dana gave this dude a layup. Dana gave this guy a layup. Okay? And this is what becometh of that layup, man. He needed this guy to be the cash girl. He needed a couple more years of out of signing. But at 34 years old and still doing the things he... And again, everyone's going to find a reason, right? If he won, it would have been good. You're right. Is he is he out of signing? You're right. If you would have won, no one, no one would be saying shit like I'm talking right now. But you didn't. So now everything is going to be scrutinized that you do. That's what happens when you lose. This guy can't even believe it. Had the reach advantage. Everyone in the seats in Australia, a moment of victory, a, more, a moment to parade Izzy out of sign as one of the greatest champions in UFC, and he loses that opportunity. This should have been a fight he took more serious than any fight he had before, and he did not. You could just look at his body and see that. You could just look at his body and see he was not the same. Now, is it the wear and tear? God, they, they, everything's pulling up. Nina Agda and Logan Paul. Lord have mercy on me. I can't get it out. Gold Digger wants it all. All right. Well, here goes one issue. This is this is not good. <laughs> this is not Why do I always, why does it always come to this? Being sued by an ex-girlfriend, Lord have mercy on me, right in his training camp. And here he goes. I hate losing, but love living. Well, I hate to say it, brother. The ladies won't like it. You saw those bunnies in the back that was waiting for you. And they, they probably already jumped ship. And I, I, let me give you the voice. Is it kind of socks? Yeah. Oh, my God. He lost to that guy? Yeah. Uh, don't don't answer his thing. We'll we'll catch him later. Oh my God, such so embarrassing. He's done with them right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm messing around. I'm just messing around. I just saw him point. There was a couple girls in the front that obviously knew out of sign and, and the faces they were making as he was getting hit were not good. It wasn't like I feel sorry for him. It was like, hey, loser. Yeah, so he's getting sued. Strike one. That could play a role a hundred thousand percent. I believe he parties too much. You saw him party at the Miami. And then you see the comment here. 
I hate losing, but love living. Know why? He got paid already, guys. And it's a common strip strip between all these guys that have gotten paid of not improving continuously once they've gotten paid. And that's the scary thing. You got Luka Doncic injured. You got you got the dude from the Chiefs. What's his name? Five hundred million. He lost his first game to the Lions. I do believe he improves all the time, though. I believe he does work on it. But this guy right here, to me, to me, too much partying and didn't continue the improvement, didn't change up his style. 34 years old, you can't keep your hands down, move your head around, and think you're 28. That prime is gone. That prime is over. And the problem is his whole fight style is based off it. Hence why John Jones is a king, because I believe John Jones can take it to the ground, one of the few. He can take you to the ground. It uh, Sonya will be a, be like a flying fish. He's lucky Strickland didn't take him down. But I'm gonna leave it at that, man. This is what happens when you underestimate your opponent, where you don't continue to evolve and improve and understand your age, you know. And when you when you mess around too much out there, you're gonna have these lawsuits that are gonna again distract you and hurt you from your training. Choose choose your your moments wisely. Is the talking point. Choose your moments wisely and understand that improvement is not something that is optional. It's mandatory. Your boy Mikey stepping off. Sonya for the loss. And guess what? Don't think he's a GOAT. Too many losses against too many mediocre guys. I'm gone. Peace.